Hey, yo, people. Today, I'll make new paradox for unevolved Pokemon. Basically, Pokemon that can evolve, but this doesn't apply to those who do have an evolution. It's like Fluttermane and his reboots. So, let's see how it does. Hey, hey, what's up, Yali? Can we imagine new small paradoxes? I wanna create some paradoxes with the power of my imagination. They did in the game. Mm, okay, go ahead. I wish I could see a reflect paradox. We spy about Tyrannosaurus Hex. Since we know some dinosaurs have feathers, and I see this cool art, so why not? Maybe it could be a compact T-Rex, like those cute, big-headed boys, and must be very angry. Let's see, let's see what I can do. Maybe something like this. I could name it Plum Direct, because makes sales with the compacts. Also, I'd inspired by Carnotaurus and Nanuxaurus, basically an Arctic T-Rex, as you can see by the similarities by its dark beak and white plumage. It could be a flying dragon type, which base that like that to be a strong manate. Its shiny colors could be brownish like the original. Just imagine this giant creature, even bigger than a tarantrum, with a roar like that. <coughs> Silly, just the way I like. A describe an M old book that this creature isn't even not so smart was an apex predator and got extinct because of its dumbness. Okay, who's next? Actually, I'm choosing suggestions from your Discord server. I'm gonna use them now. Wait, what did you see in my Discord? There are things you could I see? Chill, I can't read. I can just pick randomly some of them. Ugh, okay, let's see. Um, this one is called a Paradox Loaded Spire by a Triceratops. I think that could be very interesting. So, basically, I decided to go into a bit bond and vibe with a grumpy hideous face. It's funny how silly and small Loaded is and how big it will become. By the way, when I was a kid, I found the Loaded were grumpy because of this sprite. So, I decided to go into this vibe too. And as you can see, there is our rowdy hat. A grass ground type. He has some huge color fur, looking like his little wing that has larvista and volcano tails. But look at the war lily, it's now pointed like a triceratops crest in a bear trap or even a snack trap. Its colors is darker to reference the gem free lotion sprite too. It's shiny is inspired by the original, with ballets bestats like that. Now imagine this big creature with this silly roar. A dubious magazine says that this beard is itself in the ground, waiting for prey to step on this nanophore at close like this graphical representation. Okay, the next one is a main bear idea to create the Avalisaraptor Togetic. Queen Stedner was wanting to make a paradox Togetic long time ago, but it's crappy because as far it was whatever. And this pink of members just want to say that I'm super grateful for the donation I got, especially for the amazing asset thing you render. The channel keeps viable because of the supporters. It's thanks to the commissions, donations, and members that I can still do this. So the biggest special thanks to the legendary member and Goblin Girl, a special thanks to Jack Gilmore, by Bunny, Brow, Bruh, and Christopher Kakino, and a special thanks to all the members so far. But if you can't help with a membership that starts with just one dollar and you get perks, it can still help with a like and comment. But anyway, the Stuggy Tick is most inspired by the Little Mimus since its shape fits with Toby Tick and an accurate Velociraptor as well, and a little bit of Pekicephalosaurus. And here is Razor Lurker. <coughs> Don't get pulled by that cute roar, it's a powerful fairy dragon type it chases its prey non-stop until it faint, and when necessary, it launches the egg on its head, or firmly would hatch a paradox togepi. If inspired by fast dinosaurs, its speed is the highest of all paradoxes. It's not so big as the other paradoxes, but it's still big enough to be a trap. The shiny, unfortunately, is subtle, like the original, with the red and blue swap. So, be careful in your shiny hunting. What do you think? 
Yeah, I'll see never good to tell you. Your crazy urge car to invite one friend to live with us. You what? Are you curious how you... Yeah, I'm fake, but this is misunderstood. What do you mean your father were underage? Mm, okay, you're underage too and homeless. Please, cause can you only let me leave for you first? He's adorable. He, okay, you can stay. Just be in the basement. <laughs> oh wow, this best. That's why I will name them garlic bread. Uh huh, what's the meaning? Whatever, the next one was an idea from Squad. Let's get me a parent that's layer. I always found that Lyra has a perfect vibe for an unevolved parent that's more than itself, so I went for it. And said to be inspired by Stegoceras, Ankyloceras, and those crest dinosaurs like Triceratops. And as you can see, its plate becomes like the Stegoceras one, both the Ankyloceras body shape. The crest is visible too, but now the holes has lava inside, as well with the burning spikes. This is why I call it a united plate. <laughs> Steel fire type. It can create fire horns and spikes on the holes when it's in danger. So, even more similar to the original inspirations on the horns, looks like the aggro, a little bit. Its shiny is also green, like the original. And by its being size, it's very tanky from the physical side. What do you think? When on future Paradox Fae, it's because I don't like them too much. But okay, I could adapt this idea into a future one because matches well with Fluid. I decided to make it more like into the AZ Float. And since we are in the Pokemon Legend Z hype, so why not? I want to make these flowers like Aramoth Wings and be like a floating drone. And here is Iron Parasol. Very steel type because matches with the design and it's real good. The blue and red details are obviously a reference to the eternal fluid. Each flower can throw iron pulling spears that are heavier than its look. And sorry to disappoint you all, but it's shiny just silver as the future paradox. A paranormal magazine says that it's a robot. It was made by a giant man to resemble his old friend. And despite being small, its sides are decent and similar to the easy fluid. What do you think? Okay, what's next? Come on, again Ollie, I need you to stop using my account. Excuse me, but if I were you, I could that you will make a player and I'd sleep in the room. Of course, the water goes time. No, it's too late, and it's not related to the video topic. No, please go away. What? Why he became in diarrhea? Is he dead? Oh, dang, I'm gonna be arrested again. You are dangerous. Oh my lord, oh my lord. Oh yeah, makes yeah, sense. Yeah. Eh? And they're true, really pretty smart. smart. Mm, yeah, thank you, thank you. Okay, but what I was talking about... Oh, oh, of course. The next idea is a Paradox Wormple. I'm saying to mix a lot of your ideas to create this one. A Carnivorous, Caterpillar, and a Stegosaurus. Plus Caterpillar, and Flanger Moth. A Lucy Genia and a Water Bear. And since many people ask, I use details from Beach Ply and Dust Talks. And here is this monstrous cute amalgamat. I call it Fozimonar with this scary cry. It's a bug normal type because a new type combo with these pretty decent stats, I think it could be okay. The new stock wings become Stegosteros plates and beautifly antennas are here too. It now has a big mega horn and silly legs, a huge monster with a shiny version similar to the originals. You can see the great amount of texture I put in this one more than the others because it's my favorite of the video. What's in yours? But well, if you want to see more paradoxes, watch this video too, the ultimate paradox video. There are some unexpected ones like future paradox among us and a spider managras. Have fun, so bye bye, huggies.